when a tornadic supercell thunderstorm forms on the eastern plains of Colorado, meteorologists use a Doppler radar to get critical scans and analyze the storm's dangerous potential. The radar beam comes out of a spinning antenna and scans the storm about every six minutes, because that's how long it takes for the antenna to rotate 360 degrees. Uh, we know tornado, tornado storm can evolve rapidly, so six minutes it's like an eternity for tornado forecast. NCAR scientist Wen Chao Li is developing a new technology called phased array. With that, there's no antenna needed to create the radar beam, so it can scan in any direction at any time for as long as needed, never missing a moment of tornado development. The phased array radar can focus on the specific feature rather than have to scan around, around, around in order to sample that feature. Lee says the first phased array weather radar will be installed on NCAR C-130 aircraft. The technology itself will get evaluated while scientists use it for research. Another capability of phased array radar is something called dual polarization scanning. It allows meteorologists to see the microphysics of cloud particles. Ground-based Doppler has that ability, but for the first time, they'll be able to study that detail of storm formation and precipitation at close range on an aircraft. It, it's an excitement in the potential of using this technology to advance science to ultimately save lives and properties. Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen, Nine News. It will be a five-year evaluation and research project starting in 2028, but Lee says phased array will eventually be adopted by the National Weather Service and even local TV stations.